Hey, what's going on guys? I just want to start this video off by making a observation, okay? I've noticed recently in my in my life that Cotton Eye Joe is basically just white people Gangnam style, okay? If you agree, you agree. If you disagree, you disagree. I'm not going to explain or elaborate, but today we're reacting to a TikToker very similar to Topper Guild. This guy goes by the name Stefan Scherer. Scherer. That's such a hard last name to pronounce. Scherer. It's S-H-A-R-E-R. -E Scherer. Yeah, I probably probably just lost like 10 IQ points trying to pronounce his name. And they're definitely not going to come back after we watch his content because his content is atrocious. Come on, Cole, let's go for a ride. Yes. I can't wait to take you in on this thing. It's going to be so much fun. Hey, thanks for that. That was uh, so awesome, and I'm so glad you posted that, and I have that in my brain. Anyway, this guy kind of makes relatable comedy type stuff, and a uh, bunch of like stupid skits. Big emphasis on the stupid. But yeah, anyway, we're just going to watch some of his TikToks today, and really see how bad they are. And yeah, just leave a like on this video, and subscribe if you haven't yet already, and let's get into it. <sighs> Ew, Coley! Oh, no! Ew! This guy could get drafted for war tomorrow, just so you know. Making fart jokes. Dude is old enough to be protecting and serving on the battlefield, and he's uh, paying a girl to rip ass in his expensive car. This next prank is called Bird Poop and Expensive Car Prank. Wait for her to get closer, wait for her. Hang on, hang on. Look at this. He shot this prank literally five minutes after the one we just watched. It's the same girl in the same driveway at the same time of day. Dog, you're not slick. Here we go. So you tell me you have bird dookie in your hair and you don't even bother to look up at the sky to see where the bird is? Maybe to like prevent getting any further dump on your hair? Like, come on now. This is so obviously fake. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, let's go outside, guys. Don't want to get caught. You're such a terrible actor, man. I bet you if some guy came into America not even knowing English and I gave him 20 bucks to make a YouTube short, I guarantee you he wouldn't have made something like you that makes me want to eat a urinal cake. I'm sure it wouldn't be perfect, but bro, you are so far from perfect that even using that as the bar is crazy. Oh, you're Subscribe to find out how she gets revenge. I'd rather have an allergic reaction and be sent to the hospital than to click subscribe with notifications, dog. Hey! Welcome to Starbucks. May I take your order? Yes, please. Can I please have um, a large refresher with extra ice? Extra ice coming right up. Thank you. Oh, that looks great. Oh, Thank we are not done. This is Starbucks and you ask for extra ice. You need extra ice. Are you starting to understand why he's friends with Topper Guild? Yeah, the ice wasting is cringy, it's unnecessary, and it's just overdone, honestly, dude. Like, I know that he's not wasting actual food like chicken or burger patties or whatever, but still, like, bro, ice cubes, you're just dumping them out on the floor. You, you know, they, they have a purpose, right? Oh, you know what? That actually looks really good. Nope, you, know you said extra that? ice. Extra ice. You need extra ice. And we are going to give you extra ice. This is Starbucks. What do you mean? When you really think about it, this untalented grown man is making more money than most people I can think of off the top of my head. If you're watching this and you're working a job where you don't think you get paid enough and you're getting mad because you know this guy's like a millionaire and he makes his millions by doing awful YouTube shorts, sketches, and wasting food, your anger is justified. Bro, people plunge gas station toilets. Okay, think about that. That's a terrible job to have. And they probably make 5% of what Steven Scherer makes in a month. There you go. One refresher coming right up. Um. Enjoy. Thanks. Hey, Katie, can you help me find the eggs? I can't find them anywhere. Anywhere in here, I can't find them. Nowhere. Oh my god, it looks like Steven is looking forward when in reality his head is actually backward. Yo, Steven, bro, please just grow up. Anywhere. Anywhere in here, I can't find them. Nowhere. Oh, sure, Steven. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, what are you looking for? Right here. Ah! Oh, damn, she predicted the prank, even though literally 10 seconds before they started recording, they gave her a pep talk about what exactly to do, when to do it, and how to do it. So it wasn't predicted at all. It was scripted. S-C-R-I-P-T-E-D. Come on, hop in. 
Okay, yeah, you can just go ahead and go to prison for that. Dude, this guy literally gets millions of dislikes. H how is he getting these types of views, bro? I want those views, and for some reason, I don't get them, but this guy, this actual troglodyte, is getting millions and millions of views, and I can't even break 50k. Please, tell me why that is, and don't give me some stupid answer like, oh, your content isn't as good as his. Bro, <laughs> open your eyes. Oh, uh, yeah, all right. Oh, by the way, have you met my security guard? Wait, your security guard? Oh, oh. oh my god, the twist. I could have never seen that coming. I got a recommendation. For the next big twist in the next video, you should end it off by, you know, surprising everybody and uh, deleting your channel. Ah! Finish the lyrics challenge. Here we go. You, you are my TikTok cutie with... <sighs> This guy's doing a finish the lyrics challenge with his own song. Also, what's with these outfits? Doug, did you just get out of prison? I mean, I did ask for you to be placed under federal confinement, so if you were in prison, I, I hope they get you back there soon, man. Brown eyed baby couldn't get enough. Okay, okay. A, B, C, D, E, Z, A, Yo, sick challenge, dog. You should redo this, except you should be the one at the dunk tank, and they should replace the water with lava. Now, I know what you're thinking. Whoa, Achito, are you saying that if he failed, he would fall into the lava? No, he wouldn't fail, because he would only be singing his own songs. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Actual monkey. Like, bro, what are these sounds? I can't tell if he's trying to do it for the entertainment of his five-year-old fans, or if this is just, like, you know, how he is. Yeah. Oh. Here. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Alright, bro, whenever you're ready to quiet down. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for you, honestly, man. This guy back in class would definitely just yell for no reason, and the teacher would have to just be like, Yo, listen, Steven, Stefan, man, can you, uh, just excuse yourself for a bit? You know, you gotta, you gotta cool down. This, uh... this guy has more money than your bloodline, and you should be mad. Like, bro, think about the decades, probably centuries of hard work that every member of your family has ever put into making yourself, you know, a financially savvy family. Bro, he's got, like, double that if not quadruple, because he yells on YouTube shorts. Got my glizzy, let's stick it in the window, let's see what happens, here it goes. Dog, I'm gonna ask you, okay? You're gonna put a glizzy through a window. What do you think is gonna happen? It's gonna cut it, okay? Oh my god, the hot dog fell out after being cut in half. Wow, dude, that's crazy. I didn't expect that to happen. Oh wait, I did. I completely did. You know what's funny? I think the president of the United States, like the actual salary, is only 500k a year. Dude, this guy makes like 10 times the president. You probably can't comprehend that just by me saying it, but dude, if you think about that sentence for more than, I don't know, 10 seconds, yeah, it is pretty crazy. This next video, I shit you not, is called throwing a brick on an ambulance prank. <laughs> Yo, Stefan, somebody is dying! Guy's out here five minutes from death, and you're just pranking him? Are you kidding? Like, this has to be staged, but bro, are you kidding me? Dude is toast, and this is how you're treating him? Oh shit, get pranked, retards. You were busy dealing with a dying man, but get pranked because my brick that I threw at your car is actually made of foam. Ha, get owned. Stefan, you quite possibly costed this man his entire life for a YouTube challenge. Are you happy? I mean, you probably are because, like, I mean, that bank statement goes crazy, but, like, come on, man. Think about the ethics. Oh, what a nice day for a picnic. Who talks like this? Like, genuine question. Who just, like, exclaims, wow, what a nice day for a picnic? Like, bro, you're aware of the fact that it's a nice day. You don't have to yell it out for everybody to hear what's going on in your brain. Like, this guy sees a person in a wheelchair and goes, yo, bro, you're crippled. It's like, wow, good observation, Stefan. Are you gonna, like, you, you, you gonna stop anytime soon? Like, this person is, is just trying to, like, live. Oh, let's start snacking. This is gonna be so good. <gasps> Steven! Oh, wait a second. What did that girl say? Yo, run that back. Steven! You're telling me this whole time this guy's name was Steven? Bro, why is it spelled Stefan? What is the PH for? The f, f, not the, that's f. It's Stefan, not Steven. What? those on the beach they make so many crumbs and i am not in the mood to be attacked by seagulls no they do not they'll be fine check this out steven oh oops i told you i mean the girl is right she did tell him like uh, did she not like two seconds earlier say yo steven my dog don't don't do that yeah steven i gotta say i'm not i'm not liking your your attitude man hey can you hold my water bottles uh okay. thank you can you hold my soda bottles Right. Thank you. Actually, can you hold my plate of flour too? Uh, sure. Thank you so much. Keep holding them. And yeah! Oh! <laughs>
I'm gonna get you! Yo, that last part was not acting. I'm gonna get you! Bro, he's showing up with a gun. Yo, Steven, you're, you're low-key abusing your employees, you know? Or maybe employees isn't the right word. Maybe, like, slaves would be more accurate. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, indentured servants. I'm sorry, my fault. But low-key, imagine working for Stefan Scherer. Like, you wake up at 9 a.m. just to hear Steven howling like a dog, throwing soda bottles all across his, like, $10 million mansion. And you're like, bro, why am I doing this? Does this actually work? Okay, all you gotta do, apparently, is take some blue soda, put your injector in, put it inside your strawberry just like this. I know what you're thinking. Whoa, did he just call that orange a strawberry? This guy must be handicapped. And, okay, listen, I would agree with you if that wasn't completely on purpose. Okay, what he just did is he intentionally made a mistake in the video just to get people to comment that he made a mistake so he gets more views in the algorithm. It's funny, back when I was spam posting MCYT videos, I made a video on Wilbur Soot, and I was pronouncing it like Wilbur Soot, and everybody was like, oh, you're saying it wrong, you're saying it wrong, I have no dad. And I was like, okay. It gets annoying, but at the end of the day, it probably just helped my video do better. Oh, and inject it out. Here we go. Ooh. Okay, it's been 24 hours. Let's test it out. Get out of here with yo. It's been 24 hours looking ass, bro. It's been five minutes at most. Same shirt, same expression, same energy levels, just the same everything, bro. You're maybe fooling an elementary school dropout. That's about it. Here we go. No way, no way, no way. No way it actually worked. No way. You keep saying no way as if you didn't like literally cause that to happen. I don't know if bro's disassociating and just forgetting the things that he's done, but dude, you, you did that. I have no part in any anything that you're doing in the video. Stop saying no way as if I just like did something, bro. You did that. Anyway, somebody who's been killing it on the YouTube shorts game who I actually respect is my friend Vishremi and he's gonna actually hop on this video for a little bit and spit some of his jokes. Now, if you guys like him or you've seen him before, go check out his channel links down below and hit the subscribe button for me. Tell him a Cheeto sent you and uh, yeah, man, just take it away. What's up? It's your boy Vishremi on the A Cheeto channel. Yeah! All right, now being for real though, we're reacting to Topper Guild's like twin or some shit, Stefan Sher. But yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> I have so many questions. Like, seriously, what the f*** are you wearing? Who is this cop? And why do you run like a GTA stripper? This dude walking devious as hell. Money prank on cops. Let's see how honest they are. Yeah, because those are definitely real cops, and they definitely didn't hear you. Nah, but in all seriousness, what are you wearing? You look like Jack Frost wearing a traffic cone. Hey, officers. Hey, hey, hey. Did you guys see any money? Money. Why did it just end? Why did it just end like that? They didn't even finish the damn prank. How are you so lazy to the point where you can't finish a fake prank? This dude is lazy as shit. Oh, what a nice day for a picnic. Oh, let's start <laughs> snacking. This is gonna be so good. Like, tell me he doesn't look like Jack Frost. Wait, wait, that's the wrong that's the wrong one. Huh? Nah, but just tell me he doesn't look like him. Steven! What? You cannot eat those on the beach. They make so many crumbs, and I am not in the mood to be attacked by seagulls. No, they do not. They'll be fine. Check this out. Steven! Oh, Oops. I told you! I wonder if the kids that watch his videos, like, actually believe that that was real. Like, there's no way these kids are this dumb, right? I mean, the video got, like, 5 million views, but I guarantee everyone that watched it is still in their mom's stomach. Like, seriously, nobody over the age of 10 is gonna think this shit is funny. How did you fall for that while looking at it the entire time? Like, even if he wasn't looking the entire time, he could have looked like once to check what they were doing, making all that damn noise. He would literally have to be blind to fall for this prank. And shit, I don't even know if a blind person would fall for this because you can literally hear them fill up the water. This is what pisses me off. These pranks get like so many views, but they make no sense. The cameraman definitely used his last invisibility potion on this shit, because what the hell? Why did the security guard pretend to fall for the it? The guy is obviously filming, and also, if he would have fallen for it, why didn't he try to help him? Like, he literally was just staring at Stefan the whole time. If Stefan's hand was really getting crushed, the security guard wouldn't have done shit. If this was me, bro, I would fire this guy, to be honest, because this man has no idea what he's doing. But in his defense, his hand was literally stretching, so... Alright, I got pretty bored of this dude's crappy videos so i decided to go on the links on his channel and i found his merch site and you're not gonna believe
believe what I just saw. I scrolled down just to see a $35 lunchbox. If anybody is buying this for their kids that watch a Steph and Share, you're getting scammed. A lunchbox should not be $35. $35.99 at that. And if you look further, it just gets even worse. $17. No, $18 for a pencil pouch. Just go to the dollar store and buy one. Like, there is no way that your kids like this dude that much. For you to be buying them overpriced crappy merch. But other than that, I think that's all I gotta say about this guy. But anyways, thank you to Ichido for letting me on the channel. Anyways, keep it a hundred and I'm out of here. I can't believe this. I cannot believe this. Why are you cutting into a chip bag like it's a slice of fucking toast? You literal smurf. I was today years old, but I realized- all Like, look at this fucking idiot. Just open the bag normally. What do you have to do to open the bag of door toast? It's pronounced Doritos, you fucking nub. It's just- Go like this. That's all you, you went 24 years of your life without knowing how to open a fucking chip bag? How stupid are you? What the hell? You have to do. Anyway, subscribe if you know how to open a chip bag.